Hey there YouTube. Today I'm making a quick video showing off this Burgess bug killer and showing you really quickly how to use it. Alright, first step is to put some of the insect fluid in it. Um, this I've had for a long time. I only fog when I have big parties and uh, this has lasted me years. And I actually keep a good reservoir in here too so I don't have to mess around with filling it every time I spray. So the chemical in mine, because it's old, it's called resmethrin, but research the chemical that you buy. It's not safe for cats. None of this stuff is safe for cats. Leave the cats indoors. Don't spray around cats. Good? Let's go. Alright, fill up your reservoir. Screws on and off like that. As far as the fuel, when the smoke is white, that means you're good. If your smoke is like brown or yellow, then that means that you're burning it and you need to turn the fuel down a little bit. Hook up your propane tank. Make sure you get the long cylinders. You can't use the short stubby ones because it could allow fluid to drip out and then it'll cause a fire. Always keep it level. Don't tilt it like this. You're going to have a bad time. You can point it up a little bit. Just don't point it down. Alright, let's light it. Turn the valve on. Hear it hissing. And it's lit. Just like that. That easy. Then, you just sit there and let it burn until it reaches temperature. It'll start puffing. This is model 1443. There we go. That didn't take very long. Starting to steam. I like to go on the swamp over here and steam. See that yellow puff that came out? If it's coming out like that all the time, it's too hot. Oh wow, look at the mosquitoes swarming me. They know what's up. Look at them. Just keep puffing it around. Try to use the wind to your advantage. So the wind's kind of going to my left and I want to fog over there, so I stood to the right. And there we go. And you actually get better results if you pump the handle. I actually got this baby cranked all the way to 11 right now, and I cannot get it to turn the smoke brown. So, um, probably really hard to screw this up. Don't spray directly on the plants themselves, because that could be bad according to the manual. Then just wait a little bit. Alright, and here I am standing in the same spot I was earlier. No mosquitoes. Amazing. I wish I could find a copyright date on this so I knew its age, but look at that guy in the photo. This is in the 90s. Ah, called it. 1996. So I did a little research and Amazingly, if you're buying one of these, um, it should be about 70 bucks, but don't buy it on Amazon. They're like $115 on Amazon. If you look at Lowe's or Menards, or maybe Home Depot, I didn't check Home Depot, they're 70 bucks at Lowe's and Menards. Not this exact one, of course, because it's from the 90s, but same principles. Um, yeah. So I hope this video helped. Thanks for watching.